So we have caught a ton of redfish this year and everybody's been asking me, Wolf, how do you actually cook your redfish? And it's a blackened type recipe that my grandfather taught me, that taught pops, that taught me how to do this and I'll probably teach my little ones. This is one of your more rich recipes and it's not gonna be as fried. We serve it on rice bed with asparagus and it is tasty. My favorite one by far out there. So here's how you do it. Enough being said, try it out. Here we go. So first, you're gonna to wanna to start off with your fresh redfish. Seasoning salt, Cajun, and lemon juice with Irish butter. I'll list all the descriptions below. You are gonna need two pans. One to first go ahead and warm up your butter, which then you're gonna put your redfish in it. Let it cool so you have a nice buttery coat over your entire redfish. What this is gonna do is this will allow the seasoning to stick better to the fish. In your other pan, you wanna go ahead and have this at a high heat with about two tablespoons of butter and get it hot. And yes, I mean hot, hot. So now this is the pan where the butter is cooled. We're gonna go ahead and get the butter all over the entire surface of the redfish. And now we're gonna go ahead and start seasoning with first our Cajun, which seasoned, I use about one tablespoon, but remember this is hot stuff. So be careful how much you put on it and just do it to taste. And then again, you're gonna put about another one tablespoon of seasoning salt over their entire fish, just like this. Once you have that done, flip it over and you're gonna repeat the same thing on the other side. Again, once you've done this a few times, you'll know how much you like on your fish. So there we go. Now we're gonna put that fish directly into our piping hot cast iron pan that was full of about two tablespoons of butter. And we're gonna let this cook anywhere from three to five minutes. Once you put it in there, this is where you're gonna put one tablespoon of lemon juice directly in there and it starts making this lemony buttery smell that is gonna fill your house that will be wonderful. So now, once that's been on there for three to five minutes, you flip it and you put your lemon juice right back on the other side and you let that sit there and cook for another three to five minutes or until the fish is thoroughly cooked all the way through. As you can see, when you go ahead and start to pull it off, what you're gonna see here, it does break apart, not a big deal, now we're just gonna layer all this pile of goodness on top of a rice bed with some asparagus. So we use white rice, generally with some other types of mixed grain in it, just like this. And now grab your redfish and go ahead and start to pile it on top. One important part that we like to do is we like to serve it with asparagus. Oh, and do not forget, once you have everything all set up and ready to go, what you're gonna wanna do here is go ahead and scoop some of that sauce that you had in your pan and pile it right on top of your red fish. So I hope you liked this video. If you did, hit that thumbs up button. Remember to subscribe and I will see you on the next video.